All right. Welcome, everybody. Um, my name is Lisa Nofstinger. I'm a CME Ruby Ambassador with Plexus Worldwide. And we are going to talk about our products. My amazing team has come together, and we are um, each going to share a little bit about the products. And I'm um, just give you a little bit more information. Um, we're not going to go into too much detail just because there is um, a lot to share. But um, any more information that you need, um, please just get with the person that invited you to this call, and they'll be happy to share more with you. Um, so, um, of course, the first thing we're going to talk about is that um, we are not here to treat, diagnose, or cure anyone. Um, this is just an informational video that we, the independent ambassadors, are bringing you guys. Um, and there's lots of different things that we're going to share today. Um, it's just not just about weight loss. A lot of people hear just about weight loss um, when they think of plexus, but there's so much more to it. Um, we're going to talk about blood sugar stabilization, um, detox, breast health, um, just a lot of good health and wellness products um, when we talk about plexus. So um, everybody is in need in these products. Um, there are so many people out there that are overweight um, and not just adults, but um, kids are becoming overweight as well, so um, young kids, and so um, we need to be able to be able to teach them healthy habits, and if we're healthy adults, healthy moms and dads, that's going to be easier for us to do. Um, we're going to talk about um, how it's going to help with cholesterol and um, autoimmune issues, arthritis. Um, there's just so many things Plexus can help with, um, and so we're going to talk about that. One of the uh, main things that I love about Plexus as a nurse is that it really gets to the root of the problem. We're not just putting a Band-Aid on people's issues. And so we're actually going to talk about three main um, things. You're going to hear kind of a theme in tonight's call. And we're talking about blood sugar and stability, inflammation, and poor gut health. So um, we're going to talk about how Plexus addresses all three of those things. And the first thing that we're going to talk about is the pink drink. So... Go ahead and unmute yourself. I think Aaron, does Aaron have slow? Yeah. Can awesome. you hear me? Yeah. Can you hear me? Oh, I can. All right. well, take it away. All righty. The pink drink. So well, I guess, first of all, I'm Aaron Truitt and I'm a new ambassador. And some general, general information about it is that it's our most popular product. It um, is also the basis for all of our combos, except for one with being the um, confused. It's not a meal replacement whatsoever. A lot of people have that um, stigma with it, but it's not a meal replacement. So to use the pink drink, you mix one packet with a bottle of water. Some other people like nurses that maybe before your first meal, if you're on night shift, you know, whatever that first meal might be. So um, let's see, and what does it do? The basis for slim is that it stabilizes your blood sugars. So once you have stabilized blood sugars, it so you're not craving those sweet, you know, kind of pick-me-ups for energy. Um, when your blood sugars are also stabilized, you have better sleep. You know, you're not going this up and down route each and every night. So you actually sleep a lot better. And is your body's actually able to use the fat, break that down for the energy, how your body is intended to use it. So um, the pink, the slim also aids in healthy cholesterol and lipid levels, and it helps in maintaining either your weight or weight loss. So, and keep in mind that only burns fat, not muscle. And I'm trying to think. It's kind of all I have. Is there anything else I, I'm leaving out, Lisa? Or Sorry, I muted, I muted myself. No, that sounds great. Um, uh, There's so many benefits that we could talk day, for days and days um, about. So you did a really good job hitting those mm. highlights. <laughs> 
Oh, sorry. Um, There's another slide. <laughs> oh, is there? <laughs> you see it now? <laughs> yeah. That's my bad. That's my bad. Okay. So um, the next thing we're going to talk about is the ProBio 5, and that is me. And um, okay, so the ProBio 5. So what's so great about this probiotic is that whenever um, we're talking about the need for probiotics, we want to talk about how it's going to address our gut health. And so many people don't realize that your gut is just full of organisms, some good and some bad. So what we want is 80% good and 20% bad. Um, so um, most people have this uh, opposite. They have 20% good and 80% bad. And a lot of it is just um, our lifestyle, um, just the things that we have been exposed to. Um, if we've taken steroids and antibiotics, um, whenever you um, take a steroid, it's actually going to feed the overgrowth of those bad organisms. And um, when you take an antibiotic, which a lot of times can be very life-saving in some situations, um, but it's also going to um, knock out those good organisms. So you want to be able to take a probiotic that's actually going to replenish the good organisms that you uh, lost when you take an antibiotic. Because anti means um, obviously anti or against, and then um, biotic means life. So an antibiotic is actually anti-life. So it's actually killing everything. Um, so the ProBio 5 um, is a very efficient and a very effective probiotic. It's actually going to restore... Um, the healthy bacteria, and it has five different bacterial strains. Um, the diversity is very important. Um, it's also going to provide a, a beneficial enzyme. It's called, and I don't even know if I'm saying this right, but um, kinosanase, kinosanase, chitosanase. I've heard it different ways. Um, that enzyme is so crucial because um, it's crucial to the effectiveness of the product. The enzyme is actually going to break down the overgrowth of the bad bacteria um, like yeast. So when your gut is healthy, your immune system is going to be stronger and you're going to be more likely to absorb the nutrients from the healthy foods that you're eating and also the good um, healthy supplements that you're taking as well. Um, it's also unique because it does not need to be refrigerated. So if your probiotic does need to be refrigerated, um, then that means that the bacteria within the um, you, the probiotic is actually going to be activated immediately upon reaching your mouth or moist or heat or moisture. So your mouth is hot and moist. So if you need a probiotic that needs to be refrigerated, it's actually going to be activated as soon as it hits your mouth. And so only about 20 to 30% of that good bacteria will survive by the time it reaches your gut and your gut is where it's needed. So the probio five is actually freeze dried back, um, bacteria. Um, it's going to remain dormant. Um, the good bacteria is going to remain dormant until it's reaching your gut, and that's where it's needed. So um, that's just a quick little snapshot. Um, there are several different enzymes, obviously, that you see on the screen, um, uh, all those fun names. <laughs> um, that, that, that's just kind of a quick rundown of the ProBio5. I tell you, um, I've been taking the ProBio5 for almost two years, and within about, um, within about I don't know, uh, four or five months, I was actually able to start eating gluten again and dairy without it tearing me up because I was gluten and lactose intolerant. I also had IBS and I don't anymore. So um, it's been really great. It also helps me sleep and it helps my immune system so much. I really had bad sinus issues and um, I had two sinus surgeries. And even after the two sinus surgeries, um, my immune system still wasn't where I wanted it to be. I was still getting sinus infections. They started coming back. And um, since I started the ProBio5 and, you know, in the vitamin and everything, but the ProBio5 especially, um, I think I've had one small short-lived sinus infection and um, maybe a cold. So um, if I do get sick, I recover a lot faster and it's not nearly as severe. So this is one of my favorite products. Um, so the bio cleanse is next and I have that as well. Um, let me see. So the bio cleanse, <clears throat> um, it helps your body uh, detoxify and eliminate. So most people don't know, um, that in order to be healthy, you should be eliminating. Yes, that means pooping, uh, at least once a day. Um, so <laughs> the bio, and if you can go two or three times a day, even better. Um, the bio cleanse is, I'm going to help 
uh, with occasional constipation and helps you with the detox. So it's actually going to create an environment that is inhospitable to disease and disease can mean a lot of different things. Um, it's going to increase the oxygen in your system. So when your body is well oxygenated, it's more resistant to that disease. So um, the main ingredient in BioCleanse is magnesium. And a lot of people think when they hear the word cleanse, that it's a real harsh cleanse and it's not. What's so great about BioCleanse is that you, um, what works for you um, may be different than what works for someone else. So some people may need just one BioCleanse. I actually need four a day and I break it up um, throughout the day. And you just kind of work with your body, what works best for you. It's actually very gentle on your system. You start slow and um, it's very gentle and you just take as much as you need for your body um, to eliminate <laughs> at least once a day, if not twice. So once you hit that, that's a good healthy goal. And then however many BioCleanse that that takes for you um, is what you should um, what you should take. That's going to be your dose. So a lot of us are mag um, deficient in magnesium. A lot of us don't even know that but we are, um, and uh, the magnesium in the BioCleanse is also going to help with bloating and discomfort. Um, it contains vitamin C in the bioflavonoids, and the vitamin C actually is a really good anti, or a good um, antioxidant support, so it's really good to help with those free radicals and things. Um, and magnesium is important also because it is needed for 300 biochemical reactions in the body, and it keeps our muscles and nerve functions normal. Um, it also helps keep the heart beating rhythmically. If, um, if some of y'all may not know that, that's so important. Um, it keeps your blood sugars level and thereby um, normalizes your blood pressure. And it helps back pain, leg cramps, headaches, and it's also a natural stress reducer. Um, my husband has been on the BioCleanse and a couple other products especially the BioCleanse, I think has been one of the main things for him. And he hasn't had a migraine in over a year um, since he's been consistent with the uh, BioCleanse. Um, it's really, really helped his um, headaches, his, his migraines really. Um, so, um, and it, it's really helped me with my leg cramps. Um, and a lot of women who have issues with their menstrual cramps, a lot of people have found relief with this product as well. It's also gluten-free and 100% vegetarian. Um, oh, and there's that. I think I already said most of that. Um, so that's the triplex combo, what Aaron and I just reviewed. So the Slim, the BioCleanse, and the ProBio5. And the next thing is X Factor. Who's got it? Hey, guys. Can you hear me? hey yeah. Hey. Take it away, girl. Christy here, and I love X Factor. X Factor is pretty amazing. Um, I mean, if you put it together with the triplex combo, I mean, it, it really is truly the Fab Four. Um, there's three main things, like three main reasons why it stands alone. I mean, it gives you everything you need, um, but on top of that, it has three main features. Um, one is that and I wrote down this in detail because I didn't want to miss anything out. Um, how it actually has methyl folate um, and does not have folic acid. And it's really important because 40% of the population has a genetic mutation, the MTHFR mutation. And it's a genetic mutation, and it actually, um, with a mutation, folic acid actually will build up in the body and not it will not be metabolized um, or useful to the body. And the um, methylation actually drives the nutrients into the cells where they go to work instead of staying in the bloodstream. So that is huge, you guys, for um, people with this genetic um, mutation. And you know what? A lot of them don't even realize they have it. Um, and so that is that is great. Um, this is the second thing is that it includes the New Zealand black currant, which is a natural source of iron. Um, so people that are really struggling with like anemia um, or celiac disease, gluten, um, so that is a beautiful. And it's also um, very gentle. A lot of the iron supplements will give people tummy aches and three 
is, oh, and I love this, the, um, the patented aloe blend, which is huge. Uh, it helps increase absorption 300% more, and it's been studied, so it definitely um, has been proven to help absorption. And it's so great because a lot of vitamins, I mean, this from taking other supplements, how you know, you'll you'll see them in your and you'll see the yellow. Well, these do not do that, and so it's really huge. You actually know that it's absorbing in your body. Um, so I love that, and you can actually even with energy. It It helps your slim absorb that much more, 300% more. So it's really great. And I noticed a huge difference when I started taking my X Factor with my slim. And so I love it. And it's just, it's also um, vegetarian friendly. Which my kids, when they first tried it, they were like, oh, they're a little shocked, but then they love it. They love the kids' school. And sometimes I'll open up the, um, you know, the capsules, but I've gotten where I got the chewables again for them, but it tastes like sour grape. Okay. Thank you, Christy. Um, the next thing is the accelerator plus. It's like, I hope y'all can hear me. Okay. Yes, we can. My internet keeps going in and out, so sorry if I break up. But um, so I'm doing the accelerator. Um, just a few key points for that it is um, it works great with the slim. If you take it with the slim in the morning, whenever you Um, you don't want to use it with the boost. We'll be talking about the boost a little bit later, but just make sure not to use those two products to get this to kind of them separated. And then also just another key point just to tell people is on any kind of inside of precedent, um, we'll talk about this a little bit more, just to be cautious with those, um, with that. Um, it contains niacin, B12, Was that just me, or does anybody else hear her? Allison, I can see you. Can you hear her, Allison? No? Okay. Can you hear me now? Oh, there you are. I live out in the sticks, so my internet's not. Yes, mine too. <laughs> Um, product with the stem, like I said, and also has 5 HTP, um, which was kind of learned about it. It increases the production of serotonin, um, which is you have to be cautious with the antidepressants. Um, but so, for those of you who don't know what serotonin is, that's kind of the happy hormone. Um, it increases your mood, um, has better appetite, sleep, memories, um, and for helps with brain. So, um, Pretty cool, just increases your mood with that. Also has Herba Monte, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, um, which that I found when I looked it up had a lot of cool properties to it. It um, was a natural stimulant, it helps with allergy symptoms. Um, that improved your mood as well, so that kind of was two factors in there that increased your mood. Um, increased your fitness, and then also just helped um, with joint pains and headaches, which I thought was neat. Um, and the natural source kind of, of caffeine in it is your green tea um, extract, and that's about one cup of coffee. So I do have to separate that. That's the main reason I have to take it with food. If I take it without food, I can kind of feel that caffeine effect on me. But, um, but it's just one cup of coffee. So the hygienic, um is kind of your other natural stimulant. And I'm a nurse, too, so I was getting all in the research part of this. Um, but it said that it also helps to relax your bronchioles, which was neat for anti, you know, asthmatic stuff like that, just to pass on to people. Um, it also had chromium, which we've already kind of touched on that with the slim. 
Um, so kind of overall, it just increases your metabolism, provides energy, suppresses appetite, just accelerates your weight loss, just more in a, in a safe manner. So that is Accelerator. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, the next thing that we have is Boost. I've got Boost. Awesome. Take it away, girl. Okay. Hey, everybody. How are y'all? Um, okay. So Boost, um, one of the things I love about Boost is that it is thermogenic. And for those of you who don't exactly understand um, thermogenic, let me explain it. Um, a thermogenic product is used to increase the heat in a body's metabolism and helps their ability to burn fat and use that as energy. So um, if you've ever heard the word lipolysis, uh, hence all of the uh, health professionals, um, that is exactly what's going on in the body. So with thermogenics, you can promote weight loss. Um, and this increases your calorie burn. And I can honestly say that I have been using Boost since probably three months into it. And I use it on my high cardio days because I burn almost an extra 300 to 400 calories um, on those days, which is incredible for me because I'm up to about 1,200 calories on Tuesdays and Thursdays just by using my Boost. If I do not use my Boost, I can get through a spin class, but I'm exhausted. So <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. That is, that's all I got to say. Um, okay. So some of the things that are in it, um, Corellium uh, fimbriata is an um, edible cactus uh, that the tribal East Indians have used for years to suppress hunger and um, increase their endurance. So that's, I think, really incredible that here they were already using something that increased their endurance throughout the day. So this is, this is fantastic that we can utilize this in our ingredients. Um, yerba mate is a stimulant and a diuretic. So it basically has the strength of coffee, the health benefits of tea, and gives you the euphoria of chocolate. Ah! <laughs> chocolate in my booze, right? <laughs> I think that's right. Um, okay, and so uh, let's see. And then the um, all of this is made naturally. Um, uh, that was new to me. Um, and then we've got hygienamine and um, lotus seed extract um, that comes from the tangerine peel that's in it. Um, so taking your boost first thing in the morning with your slim, um, I normally take my boost and my X factor first thing. And then about 20, 30 minutes later, as I'm on my way out the door before my workout, I take my boost. So I'm generally getting it in almost 30 minutes before my workout. in my um, deep-seated study on thermogenics. <laughs> I didn't add that in. Um, but you know, some people, we had some com um, conversation today on uh, one of our threads about it upsetting um, some people's stomachs and um, also with heart raising. So, you know, you do have to be careful. This is one of the ones that is recommended not to take if you're on a blood pressure medication. Um, and also not to take with accelerator. Um, they do say that you can rotate these, um, but that you should allow uh, downtime between the two. Um, I can say I rotate them, but I only take accelerator if I know I'm really not going to be working out for a few days, then that's my go-to instead of the boost. And again, it's starting out with one and then slowly increasing to two. And if it's a, if a, if it's a heart rate um, increase that lasts for, you know, longer than 30 minutes, then you, you should be leery of taking it um, without somebody else monitoring you. So in case something is, is seriously um, causing an issue, then you know, the other person knows what's going on. But um, as far as 
making you nauseous. I think um, that has been noted with several today that eating before you take boost is recommended as well. That's all I have. Excellent job, Ashley. Thank you. So Block is our next product. I have Block. Yay, Allison. Yes. You can hear me. Okay. okay. All right. So Block is what it, it says what it does. It blocks 48% of carbs and sugars that we intake. Um, the new block is quick acting, so it can be taken right before you eat or while you're eating. Um, it's also known as a cheat meal supplement. There are several important things about block. Um, the first thing is, is it slows the absorption of starches and sugars to help maintain healthy glucose levels. The second thing is it reduces starch and sugar by converting to glucose up to 48%. It acts as an appetite suppressant. It reduces the glycemic index for foods. It promotes healthy weight control and it minimizes free radical and oxidative stress. So there are two main ingredients that make block so special. Um, first one is white kidney bean extract. And it's basically what's fighting against the carbs that you intake. When you eat, there's a little enzyme once food gets into the intestine. That enzyme is looking to chomp your food. It breaks down the chain of foods and makes them into little particles. Those particles either turn into sugar, which gets absorbed into your body to later turn into fat, or it raises your blood sugar. When you take white kidney bean extract first, it blocks that enzyme, which paralyzes it, um, and it can no longer chomp. So that food comes in and keeps will eventually be eliminated. Um, thank you, BioCleanse, for that. And um, that food just doesn't become part of your body, and that's where the glucose comes into play. The second ingredient, um, and it's kind of like a game changer, what, it's what makes block unlike anything else on the market, and it's NC2 ground seaweed blend. Um, it focuses on the sugar intake. It's similar to what white kidney bean does with enzymes, but it focuses more on the table sugar that we eat. There Glycemic index measures how a carb-containing food affects or raises blood glucose. So it's really important for diabetics. This supplement is going to help keep your blood glucose in control. And it's also going to help stabilize your insulin. Fat burner. Ground seaweed is naturally occurring iodine. So your thyroid needs iodine to produce hormones. So people with no thyroid or little thyroid function It expands and takes up room in your stomach, which causes you to be full and not to eat too much. Um, so how do you take block? Uh, you can take two before your two biggest meals, so generally lunch and dinner. Um, I normally suggest starting off with one. Um, before um, it really fills me up with just one, so I typically only take one, but everybody's different. So I just kind of want to leave y'all with this. If you knew of something that's going to keep you from overeating, going to block almost half the carbs and sugar you are eating, and then continue burning fat throughout the day, why would you not want to take that? We have all of that in block. That is that's, a, it. that's a good point. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so the next thing is the ease capsules, and I'm sorry to tell y'all that y'all have to listen to my voice again, because that's me, again. Um, so the ease capsules, so <clears throat> um, there's a, um, a statistic out there that says that 100 million people 
100 million people suffer from chronic pain, um, which is about um, one in three here in America. Um, so we're looking at osteoarthritis, rheumatoid arthritis, fibromyalgia, headaches, um, all kinds of pain. Um, so this is actually a great natural alternative uh, to the everyday pain relief meds that we take. Um, if you've had a chronic headache, um, a back or neck pain, um, like I said, these plexus, these capsules could be a great alternative for you. Um, it's so much more gentler on your kidneys and on your stomach lining. Um, and then, of course, the gut lining as well. Um, all prescription medications um, can affect your stomach and your gut lining. Um, so it's really great if you have a natural alternative. Um, people that are recovering from a sports injury or surgery, um, someone that has an active lifestyle, a lot of times can have that chronic pain. Um, even if it's a good pain, you know, from working out, um, it's that chronic pain that you're having. And this is a great alternative um, to ibuprofen or um, leave or naproxen or something like that. Um, so um, once you've been taking this um, for a little bit, you're going to notice that your discomfort's becoming less and less um, in these ingredients, which are gluten-free. Um, one of the main ones is the Ederol, which is the, or ETA, Ederol. Um, it is a patented green lip muscle, and it contains all of the potent and wide-ranging properties of its sources. It's including, um, including the joint support. It's also going to help asthma patients, um, and this is according to a double-blind study, it was able to help uh, um, asthma patients. Um, it's more effective than omega-3 um, to help regenerate joint um, tissue, so that's kind of amazing. The turmeric extract is a powerful anti-inflammatory, and it's um, been used for centuries, um, and it's very uh, beneficial for natural pain relief. Um, serapeptase, it's known as the miracle enzyme, and it's an anti-inflammatory agent as well, um, and there's actually more than 25 years of research um, been done in Europe. Um, and all over, um, and it delivers significant relief without the usual side effects. Um, it's gonna thin the fluids, which actually speeds up tissue repair. So that's kind of an important ingredient as well. The bromelain, it's another enzyme, and it's shown to possess substantial anti-inflammatory. And um, if you can see um, a, a trend here, um, most of your pain that you have is due to inflammation. So in order to get rid of the inflammation, you have to have an anti-inflammatory. So that's why there's so many of those in here. Um, so that's bromelain, anti-inflammatory and anti-pain um, for the entire body. Um, there are no side effects that have been reported um, with the ease capsule. Um, the only concern is that if you are allergic to shellfish um, because of the green lip muscle in the Ederol. So um, some people, have questions on how to take the ease capsules. Um, it works differently for different people, depending on how long you've been hurting and what's hurting and what else you got going on. But um, so it depends on what you're dealing with. Um, so we're going to look at two different um, scenarios. So minor pain, which is like associated with exercise, um, overdoing it, you know, things like that. You're going to take um, one to three capsules every four to six hours as needed. Um, just start with one, um, then you're going to gauge how effective it is um, with just, you know, dealing with that particular pain. Um, for chronic pain, um, for people that are going to need it, you know, for long-term use, um, you're going to, this is kind of a loading dose, you may have heard it called, but two capsules three times a day for the first two months. And then the third month, you're going to go down to two capsules twice a day. And then the fourth month, one to two capsules two times a day. So um, a lot of I won't say a lot. Many people don't need that much. Um, again, it just depends on how long you've been dealing with the pain, what other, um, what other disease processes or um, what other situation you got going on. Um, of course, um, you need to discuss with your doctor before you come off any pain meds and switch to this. If you're a chronic pain med user, um, you want to discuss this with your um, doctor. So um, let's see. Hang on one sec. <clears throat> okay, so me again. Sorry, the ease cream. <laughs> um, okay, love this stuff. So the ease cream um, is it's for temporary relief of discomfort due to an active lifestyle, um, working out, um, um, or just you know walking too much. Um, I went to Vegas last summer for convention and we were walking 
all the live long day everywhere. And um, it seems like no matter what kind of shoes you wore, your feet just hurt because you walked all day. And a lot of times it was on concrete. So um, this ease cream, I took it with me, thank goodness. And it was really great um, for my sore feet. So um, it's going to help uh, the body to re reduce discomfort quickly, safely, and effectively. You're just going to rub the cream on the area, giving you the pain. And it really just takes a couple of minutes. Um, and you're going to have that um, relief that you're looking for. Um, it, um, you're going to provide the synergistic um, inside out relief when you take the plexus ease cream with the capsules. So like for arthritis sufferers, you can take the ease capsules and then rub the cream on that area where you're having that pain, you know, due to arthritis, you know, for chronic arthritis. If you take both and um, you're going to get a better effect. It's non-greasy. It really does have a really good scent to it and smells kind of minty. Um, it's easy to use. Um, for me, it works. I really like it. Um, it's also good for bug bites and um, sunburns as well. Um, just any kind of inflamed skin issues, um, joint and muscle pain. Now, you don't want to use this um, Ease Cream on areas of broken skin. Um, you don't want to use it on a cut or anything like that because it will burn. So make sure that it is closed skin um, where you're going to apply it to. Um, and then the ingredients is that uh, NSN, glucosamine, conjointin, peppermint, aloe, witch hazel, New Zealand green lip muscle, um, again, the ETA or the Edderall, uh, sweet almond oil, menthol, lavender, and green tea extract. So it's really good stuff and it's natural. Um, I love it. Let's see. Next, we have nerve and um, I will use both the slides on this, I promise, this time. <laughs> I seem to be missing everybody's slides. I will promise I use both, I promise. So you just take it away. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay, Sorry, good. I muted myself. I'm saying yes. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good. All right. Can you see me? Because I just see you, Lisa. So if my head's like off, just let I me know. can see you, but I have everybody on the right hand side. So some people's options okay. and you not, but I can see you. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right. So, um, so nerve is one of our, um, products that really aren't it's one of the least popular products that we have right now that most people don't know a whole lot about. Um, so that was one of the reasons why I picked it. I wanted to learn more about it. Um, so plexus nerve, um, it can help, um, regrow damaged nerves and it can support proper function of those nerves. Um, there are basically what I learned was there are three main ingredients um, to plexus nerve that helps you regenerate the damaged nerves. One of them is called, I'm not going to pronounce this right, but that's okay. Um, it's called methylcobalamin. So what that is, is your body usually has, your body usually gets that from B12, right? any B12 that you take in, but then our body has to convert it into methocobalamin. But nerve, it's already converted, so our body doesn't have to convert it, which is really cool to think about. Um, what does that do for you? It can increase um, your physical energy. It encourages detox. Um, it also supports brain and nerve health, and it supports it because the methocobalamin can cross the blood-brain barrier without the conversion because it's already converted. Um, it also can stimulate serotonin, which is your happy hormone, and um, it acts on your onto your nervous system. Uh, let's see. The last thing that the methocobalamin does is it neutralizes your um, homocysteine. So what that does, if you have increased levels of that, um, what it does is it can decrease your risk of heart ingredient. The second ingredient that's really um, the main of plexus nerve is acetyl L carnitine or what they call MRM. So that is actually a natural remedy super antioxidant. And that specifically benefits your brain. It can benefit um, cognitive ability, which is like your memory and your mood. Um, 
And it has been found like there has, some, there's some research out there that I found that said that it can improve blood sugar on some type two individuals, which, you know, this obviously is just what, this is not compliant. You can't like post this publicly, but, um, <laughs> this is what I found. So I'm telling you, um, it can also decrease your risks of Alzheimer's. Uh, the last ingredient for that is alpha lopaic acid, which is also in our slim. Um, what is, it's an antioxidant. It helps prevent certain kinds of cell damage in our body. It restores vitamin levels of E and C. Um, it improves the function and conduction and conduction of neurons if you have diabetes. Uh, and then it, it can break down the carbs to make energy and it can protect the brain under certain conditions. Um, so basically what I learned from nerve is that I need to be on it because I don't want to ever get any of that. I don't want Alzheimer's and I um, don't want to have, you know, any kind of liver problems. Um, and like, how, how awesome is it that there's a ingredient in there that we don't even have to work. Anyway, that's what I learned about nerve. I hope that helped y'all. That was awesome. As always, you did a great job. Thanks. All right, the next is the breast kit, breast check kit. I think that's Letitia. There you are. Me? Yes, there you are. Hi. Okay, hi. Okay, so um, the breast check kit can be used by men and women. Um, some may not know that Plexus started as a breast health company, and the breast check kit was the very first product that Plexus created. Um, it consists of two micro thin layers of polyurethane with non toxic lubricant steels in between. When placed on the breast, the bottom layer gently adheres to the skin and remains stable, allowing the air to slide freely over the bottom layer and friction is greatly reduced. This results in sensory touch magnification and you can touch something as small as the grain, a grain of sand. Um, and in other words, your sense of touch is greatly improved, thereby improving the effectiveness of all breast self breast exams. Okay, and then I also have um, body cream. Um, the body cream is unique skin hydrating cream made from spirulina. I'm sorry, I mispronounced that word. But, um, spirulina algae and activating charcoal. Um, the body cream is a rich blend of aloe, sweet, almond oil, grapeseed oil, evening primrose oil, and lavender oil. Activated charcoal helps fight against age advancing toxins and re removes impurities from your skin. Um, the body cream can be used not greasy and it goes a long way. Um, I have a lot of people ask me like how big is the bottle and, and it is only three ounces, but it lasts a long time because you really don't need a lot of it um, for really any of the uses that you use it for. Um, the body cream improves the appearance of the skin and texture as far as the skin texture and tone. Um, Plexus actually used to call it the um, Dr. Spencer's breast cream. Um, and then it was created to drain the lymph lymphatic system in the breast for women undergoing radiation treatment for breast cancer. When 
Plexus found out that many were using it in other areas of the body and it was successful in those uses, Plexus added the activated charcoal and called it body cream. The body cream has also now been used for scars, sunburns, diaper rashes, acne as a moisturizer used for dark spots, aging spots, stretch marks. I just find it crazy that you can use it for so many different things, but that's pretty amazing. So that's all I have. Yes, it is. And um, also something that kind of came out last year was you can actually use this for your hair. I don't know. I think a lot of us have tried it for our hair. Um, and I was a little bit nervous because I have, because I'm getting older, um, I have dry hair on the ends and then oily hair um, closer to the, you know, my crown. And so I was kind of nervous using it, but I actually used it um, straight out of the shower. And it actually really did help with the flyaways and actually gave my hair body. And it's really crazy that this stuff that has so many different kinds of oil um, can actually make your hair um, a lot lighter and non-greasy. And it was really, it was really nuts, but it was really great. Um, so I've used it for that as well. And um, I've used it on, on my kids and um, it's actually really good for, not only can I use the ease cream for like bug bites and things like that, I use the body cream as well. Um, and on my feet, um, I've used it, you know, dry heels and things like that. So it's crazy, Letitia, you're right, the, how many different ways we can use this. So it's good stuff. All right. Um, who's got Plexus 96? <clears throat> I do. Yay. Take okay. it away. All right. Um, I have I have my little packet of it here. Um, I volunteered for these because I absolutely love them and I've used them forever. Um, well, since I've been using Plexus. So um, P96, um, you can get it in uh, two flavors. You've got clit or vanilla, and it's a whey protein. Um, a lot of you guys um, may know what whey is. Um, you hear it as a little kid with Little Miss Muffet eating her curds and whey. I didn't know what whey was. So um, whey is the liquid part of milk that separates during cheese production. So a little on the top, that's whey it's separated. So um, it contains uh, all nine of the essential amino you know, acids and it's low in lactose content. Um, it's also, it's a hundred calories, but we call it P96. Um, so that's confusing to me. Um, 15 grams of protein, um, three or four grams of carbs, depending on whether you're using the vanilla or the chocolate. It is from uh, cold pressed uh, grass-fed cows, and you hear a lot of things about cold press lately. Um, they'll talk about cold brew of coffee and things, um, so I looked more into what cold press means, um, and it says it retains many of its fragile immune factors and nutrients, leaving it loaded with the ideal blend of easily absorbed amino acids, anti-inflammatory immune factors, um, metabolism-boosting peptides, along with potent antioxidants and alkaline materials. That's why um, P96 is great to use after a workout. Um, you can also use it as a snack, like in between um, your meals. It's great for on the go uh, because it can be mixed easily or you can do it smoothie-like um, and add fruits um, or some like spinach to it as well to make it more hearty. Um, but, uh, like you can go to Pinterest and they have a million different recipes for them um, again I usually use the chocolate one with the frozen banana and coconut milk and blend it together it's super good it's like a chocolate banana and then um, vanilla you can do that one super easy with like spinach frozen fruit strawberries bananas uh, coconut or almond milk uh, and again those are just like a hearty um, smoothie to do um, but they're great you can just mix it with the liquid anyways just keep in your purse diaper bag whatever and that is P96. That is awesome. Yes, I love, <clears throat> um, I've used the spinach and of course, um, um, pineapple is one yes. of my favorites. And um, pineapple banana is really good. Too. Yes, so, anything um, really with any of the fruits in it's really good. Um, my exactly. internet cut out just a little bit. I don't know if you meant, did you mention that you can also put this in like muffins and um, protein balls and I didn't know, okay, sorry. I, 
I didn't, but I made those protein balls with it. I had posted that um, on oh, you did? Um, I think Instagram and there. Yeah. And, and they were super easy and really good. Um, yeah, but it is good. It's just a fun way, you know, if somebody, um, if somebody doesn't want to use it in a smoothie or whatever, it's a fun way to get your protein in and, you know, it, like little it, protein balls or muffins or pancakes or gosh, there's a lot of. You posted one of those too. A question just popped up about the sugars in it. And I just have my little, my little packet. It's sweetened with stevia. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, yeah there we mm -hmm. go. Which is plant-based and natural. So good stuff. Yeah. Good for so um, good. diabetics. Mm -hmm. And they're really good too, because they're not, a lot of protein um, drinks are really chalky or gritty tasting. And these aren't like that at all. So they're really, really good. Um, the chocolate ones to me, sometimes for me, sometimes are just a little bit. So I just add just a little bit of water and boom, it's perfect. So it's, it. it's fun that you can add some, um, you know, you can kind of play around with it. So I love it. That was a great job. Thank you. Oh, thanks. All right. So the next is Mega X. That's me too. Oh, awesome. All right. So, so Mega X. Um, a lot of times we hear um, the, um, you've got your Fab Five. So you've got your Triplex and then your X Factor and your Mega X. Um, Mega X is wonderful. And this one is, again, uh, one that is near and dear to my heart because it was one of the first things that I ever started taking. Um, when I started Plexus and I was pregnant uh, taking these, again, we're not doing not compliant. So um, I, it was um, great for great for me. Um, your body's not produce uh, a lot of the essential of fatty acids needed just for daily life. So a lot of people, you have to have a supplement to get those. And um, through research, it said the number one supplement after a vitamin is an omega-3 supplement. And um, ours are plant sourced instead of the fish, which give you the yucky fish burps. Um, but the wonderful thing about Mega X is you've got, it's loaded with all of your omegas. So you've got three, six, nine, five, and seven. Um, it's non-GMO, gluten-free, vegetarian. Um, I'm just gonna hit some of the highlights of each one of the omegas. Uh, you could lose yourself in research with omegas because there is just so much out there on it. Um, but omega-3 helps with cardio vascular and brain health, uh, mental uh, behavior, and better sleep. Um, a lot of us post about the ProBio 5 and your Mega X and uh, the amazing sleep that you get. And it's so true. I slept better. I, I slept as good pregnant as I did not pregnant. And that's unheard of. Um, uh, Omega-6 is a uh, brain function and development. Um, so again, three is brain health, but then you've got brain function and development on there, which is so important. Um, omega-9 is a positive effect on your uh, cholesterol, good overall immune response, reduces insulin resistance, um, and uh, boosts insulin sensitivity. Then you've got omega-5 is great for digestion and hormonal uh, balance. And then seven reduces cholesterol, triglycerides, and aids in weight loss. Um, and then when you have five and seven combined, that's when you get anti-aging effects. Uh, and it's in our ability to nourish and sustain healthy cells in the digestion tract and skin. Um, so again, it is just these huge hard pills, um, but um, again, it's the ahi flour. I don't know if I said that. And so um, they press the ahi flour and get the oils from that. So again, that's where your plants uh, based, where you don't have to deal with like mercury from fish. Um, you can get into the research too, where it's, um, they're talking about the creole fish. So if you're into uh, fishing and not wanting to, you know, I, get, kill the little fish down there that feed the other things in the ocean. So you can use the plant sourced mega X. So, um, great, great vitamin. Yes. I, I love this stuff. <clears throat> um, yes, it definitely helped me sleep better as well. Like I thought I was already sleeping well on just, you know, the triplex and I add this stuff and it was just like, Oh, just a new level. It was awesome. 
Right. Mm -hmm. and, and my doctor, again, he was like, you know, this is, this is great. Uh, take this. So, um, yeah, it's so yeah. good. I mean, so many, like you said, so many people, um, need it. I mean, everybody needs it if they're not getting it from, you know, their, their diet and most of us aren't getting enough. And so this is such an important vitamin. And I love the fact that it's plant-based and you're right that it's teeny tiny. I mean, they're really, really small. Yeah. Um, yeah. Easy to go down. <laughs> right. Exactly. All right. Well, thank you. Um, and last but not least, our little powerhouse edge. That's me. Again, I know y'all are excited. Okay. Yes. Um, <laughs> I'm just messing. Okay, so um, this is our newest product, as y'all can see on the screen here. Um, so it, I personally never tried this, um, mainly because I get enough energy just from the slim. I, I'm afraid that if I took Edge, I would just like run around the building and not stop. I'd be like my two year old. <laughs> there does not need to be another one of those in this house. <laughs> um, okay. So anyway, um, what is edge? Edge is all natural again, part of our theme for tonight. And, um, it, one of the capsules equals, um, one cup of coffee. The three main ingredients that you see are the energy boosting three, three acrine, three acrine, probably not saying that right, but that's okay. And, um, you get that from the kucha tea leaves. Um, it increases dopamine and it decreases stress, which is pretty cool. And then we have the L theanine. That comes from the green tea, green tea leaves. It helps with you um, getting focus, um, your memory. Um, I mean, it's all natural. And then we have the natural caffeine, which you get from coffee robusta. Coffee robusta. I don't know. I'm not Spanish, but it sounds Spanish. <laughs> Okay, so there's no sugar, no sodium, which is great for your athletes, right? Because I have so many athletic friends, and most of them are all like, I can't eat sugar, and I can't have the sodium. Um, so anyway, that might be a really good option for your um, really athletic friends slash trainers. Um, let's see. What else did I learn about it? I have my notes on edge, like went everywhere y'all. Um, it's gluten free. It's also a vegetarian. Uh, let's see it. Okay. So another thing I found out about it was a lot of people wonder like, well, why do I need to take edge or why would I want to take edge? weight management. Um, so for example, one of the key ingredients in boost that we talked about earlier, um, is a hunger suppressant and the one in accelerator, um, it, it is to help sustain the energy while improving concentration and your focus. So it is a little different. I mean, you're still getting the the caffeine and the powerhouse of that, but you're not getting the burning the fat and the metabolic rate from the edge or from the boost and an accelerator. It's getting late y'all. Like, <laughs> I start going down here. <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, it is, I, we don't recommend it if you are pregnant. I don't think it's recommended while you're pregnant. Um, if I'm wrong, you can correct me, but pretty sure I read that. Um, it is safe for long-term use. It's not going to hurt you. And I have heard that it can help people that have ADHD. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, that's all I got on edge. Awesome. Good job. Well, that rounds out the um, product 
training video. Um, thank you guys all for coming. We hope that um, you all learned a little bit something. I always learn a little bit something every time that um, we do these and I love hearing a little bit of tidbits from everybody's um, different research and um, the different ways that it's helping um, people. So um, thank everybody for coming. And if you have any questions about these products, please get with the person that shared um, this link with you um, or get with your upline. So I hope you all have a good night.